Mickey's Adventures in Blobo Sitting. What's that sound? Greetings, Rusty and Ruby of Earth. It is very nice to make your friendship once again. It's great to see you again too, Shaz. But on Earth, we still don't say hi by putting shoes on our head. Oh, I forgot. Aww. Who's your friend, Shaz? This is my pet Blob. I named him Blobbo. You're a cute little Blob. Yes, you are. <laughs> So, why are you back on Earth, Shaz? Are you looking for more Earth music? <laughs> that means no. This time I've traveled across the universe on a very important mission. It's two for one day at Sammy Scoop's Ice Cream Shop, the best deal in the universe. I was hoping you could watch Blobbo for me while I obtain the precious Froyo. Sure thing. What do we need to do? <laughs> There are only two Blobbo sitting rules. First, never let Blobbo out of his pet carrier. Second, never let Blobbo eat anything. That would be bad. But feel free to look at him all you want and go, me, 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 me. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Rusty and Ruby of Earth. Goodbye, Blobbo. Okay, guys, remember the rules. Never let Blobbo out of his pet carrier. And never let him eat anything. <laughs> oh no, Blobbo got out of his pet carrier. We'll get Blobbo back. We just need a better way to catch him. I know just the thing. Our vacuum car. We can use the vacuum hose to suck up Blobbo without hurting him. After him! 
There you go. Hope your family enjoys the tutti frutti. Why, thank you. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. Lobo, you've been eating things. Lobo, come back! Sorry, Shaz. Lobo got out of his pet carrier. Why did he run away from you? Lobo does not like cold. Cold things will make him small again. Luckily, he only eats yellow things. It is his favorite color. How big can Blobbo get? According to my calculations, there is good news. Blobbo cannot get much bigger than... <gasps> the entire town. Ooh, perhaps this is not good news at all. Where did Blobbo go? We need to find him and shrink him before he grows large enough to absorb your town. Hmm. Blobo doesn't like the cold, so maybe an ice ray would do the trick. Affirmative. That would stop Blobo and shrink him to his normal size, but the ice ray would need to be bigger than an 11 legged bork bork to work. I think that means we need a giant ice ray and something big enough to carry it. Not something, someone. I know who can do it. Botasaur, we need you. <laughs> We haven't caught Blobbo yet, buddy. But I think you can help us. Let's combine it and design it. We'll start with Botasaur because he's big and strong. Then we'll give him a Froyo powered ice ray to cool off Blobbo. treads so he won't slip on the ice. Put it all together and we've got our plan. Time to go mobile. The cold's making 
Green Blob will shrink, just like Shaz said it would. Are you okay, Blobo? <laughs> He's okay. Thank you again, Rusty Ruby and Botasaur of Earth. That means I'm very, very happy. I hope your family enjoys the Froyo, Shaz. They shall surely blork their creme locks when they see all the flavors I brought them. Let's crank an awesome Earth jam, Blobbo, to get into the flying groove. <laughs> Monster truck. And that should do it. This new trailer's perfect for moving my big animals around when they need doctor visits. It'll give them a smooth ride, thanks to its monster wheels. <laughs> I think the penguins want to play. Let's get some toys. Do some tricks, monkeys. Wow me. <sighs> You call that entertainment? <laughs> Maybe the penguins will be more fun. <laughs> I'm leaving. I don't know anyone that's fun. There you go. <laughs> Aw, thanks, Frankfurt. I really do love taking care of animals. <laughs> you can say that again. Wow, you understand everything Frankfurt says. Oh, I understand all animals, even robotic ones. <laughs> oh, the penguins want to play monkey in the middle. <laughs> want to help me feed the elephants? <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Them. They love that! Oh, but it's way back at the animal park. Time to get some bits on the fix. Whirly, we need you to get the penguins ball from the animal park.
there's monkey mayhem at the playground. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right there, Officer Carl. Hold tight. <laughs> Officer Carl wasn't kidding. This is a lot of monkey business. <laughs> Follow the leader. I know who'd make a great monkey leader. A giant robotic gorilla. Botarilla, we need you. <laughs> Hi, Botarilla. We need your help getting these monkeys back to the animal park. <laughs> Monkey slobber. <laughs> Is that a giant robotic gorilla leading a monkey conga line, Frankfurt? Frankfurt? Wait, did I leave him at the animal park? Frankfurt! <laughs> Thanks, Botarilla. The monkeys and penguins are back. Safe. Aww. He stayed because he likes the elephants better than me. Looks like I'm not wanted anymore. They love you, Frankfurt. You're speaking their language. <laughs> that can pick them up. Something that can drive up tall mountains and over big rocks with huge wheels like Anna's trailer so we can go anywhere. You really want to help Frankfurt? He says yes. Then let's combine it and design it. We'll start with Frankfurt. Then we'll add monster truck wheels so we can bounce right over obstacles. And monster rockets so we can catch up to the elephants. Put it all together and we've got our plan. Time to go mobile.
monster truck? You're amazing! <laughs> There's one more elephant, and it's back in Sparkton Hills now. Full skunk ahead! <laughs> I could be as fun as an elephant. <laughs> Grasslands, Frankfurt. Oh, I love this story so much. That's my buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Rusty's Dinosaur Snow Day. You need me, call me! We're back! Hey! Give me some wing! Ah, uh, it's great to be back on nice, warm Dino Island. It's cold and snowy back in Sparkton Hills. Right! Snow! Yeah, totally! What snow? snow? I have an idea. Want us to build a snowmaker so you can play in the snow? Yeah! Ruby, time for a snow show. It's snow time. <laughs> this is called skiing. I'm going to do this skiing thing too. Snowballs are fun. <laughs> I got you! <laughs> what are you doing to my island? And what is that strange white stuff? Snow's awesome for building forts! And you can build snowmen or snow bots. <laughs> so it's snow that they love, is it? I will take the snowmaker and keep all the snow for myself! <laughs> Go. I'm gonna guess it went that way. Those footprints are from Frankosaurus. Who knows what he'll do with our snowmaker? We need to get it back fast. That's my favorite word. Hop aboard. <laughs> I know. No, no, no! a good-looking snowman. Give us back our snowmaker, Frankosaurus. What's that? That's not yours. Oh, you want snow? Then King Frankosaurus will give it to you! This is fun or bad? No, wait. I know for 
sure now. It's bad! Ah! I like skiing better! I have an idea. Let go! Okay! That was awesome! But it's too slippery on the slopes. We can't get up there this way. You can't stop King Frankosaurus! No way! <laughs> Dance time! <laughs> oh yeah! All right! I'm the king! The snow stuff is fun! We couldn't climb up! The snow's too slippery! Because it's getting colder! If it doesn't stop snowing, the whole island will be frozen by nighttime! And then it will be too cold for anything to live here! I have an idea! We can fly to the top of the mountain on deck! I'm ready to lend a wing! Let's get extreme! Let's go! Yeah! Don't they ever give up? I know just how to stop them! I'll freeze that bot's wing so he can't fly! <laughs> Gliding, Rusty! You too, buddy. Great job! But we still don't have the snowmaker. We need to stop Frankosaurus and get it back before the whole island freezes over! <laughs> we need to get up the mountain without Frankosaurus seeing us. Oh! He won't see us if we sneak up the backside by the ocean. Great idea! But we'll need a super climber for that. It's very steep. Steggy's great at climbing. And with a few tweaks, she could melt snow. Dino Tastic! Let's combine it and Dino Design it. We'll start with Steggy. Then give her special heat absorbing back plates to gather sunlight. And finally, heat vision goggles to melt the snow. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Ronnie, we need you. Bronco on the Bronco. All right. Turn that snowmaker off! 
Hit it, Steggy. Going down! Gotcha! And now, I escape again! <laughs> you can't stop me, because I'm the... Whoa! I meant to do that. They're up to. Thanks for the snow! That is so cool! <laughs> <laughs> I'm off to take a nice jungle stroll. Call me if you need a Bronto on the Bronto. That's funny. Velocity said she'd meet us here. <laughs> I think I hear her. This way. <laughs> hey, Velocity. Whoa! Hi, Ruby. Hi, Ruby. The baby raptors and I are playing tag. I love tag. <laughs> That's good because now you're in. Now you're it! <laughs> Not for long! <laughs> hey, you're it! Yeah. 
Are you all right? I'm okay. Yeah, but the chasm's too big for Brawny's tail now. Don't worry. We'll find another way to reach them. Time to gear up dino style. We'll launch a grappling hook to the other side. Heads up over there! Cable secured. All right, Brawny, time to use your head. Our very own Dino Island zip line. Let's zip. Velocity. Oh, we need something like a super fast motorcycle or a super fast raptor cycle. I like the sound of that. Let's combine it and dino design it. We'll start with velocity, then add a motorcycle frame with extra engine power. And a sidecar that's just the right size for three raptor babies. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. All right. Power. 
will make quite a tail. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. You're safe. Really, truly safe. I'm so very, very... <laughs> uh, sorry. No more jumps today. together. <laughs> That's her way of saying thanks. <laughs> Glad we could help. Good news! There's no more steam underground, which means there won't be shaking above ground for a very long time. Hey! Who wants to play tag again? We'll stay far away from the chasm this time. Sounds great. And guess what? You tell me what, 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 what? You're it! <laughs> oh, you're gonna get it now! <laughs> Ready or not, here I roll! Rusty in the search for Ozzy. It's good to be back on Dino Island. Let's go see what Oliver and Ozzy are up to. Oh, yeah, the Elbros. I love those guys. I checked Dino Lagoon and went all around the volcano. Where could he be? <gasps> Ozzy! Oh, you're not Ozzy. And hello. Is everything okay, Oliver? No, Ozzy went off to find his favorite berries hours ago. He should have been back by now. Don't worry, I'm sure he's not lost. He knows this island like the back of his hand. You'd think so, but he gets lost in our own camp. Don't worry, Ruby and I will find him. Brawny has the longest neck on Dino Island. Perfect for spotting Ozzy. It's true. You guys rock. Oh, uh, that's what Ozzy would have said. Ready, Brawny? Up on, let's go find our friend. I'll stay here in case he comes back. Call us if you find him. Here goes a pronto on the pronto. <laughs> Do you see Ozzy? No Ozzy yet. We'll find him. He can't be far. Ozzy, where are you? Made it. Got to check the guidebook to make sure it's the right berry. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yep, these are the extra tasty berries. They're very tasty. <laughs> Hear what I did? Oh, oh, right. No one's here but me. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Best day ever! Bye, Pax! So much for the best day ever. Ooh, my day just got better. <laughs> ah, okay, that bush is alive. I'm gonna stay over here. Ozzy! We miss you! Where are you? This isn't working. Okay, we can't see Ozzy, but maybe we can hear him. All we need to do is make a super listening device. Yeah. Let's make something great! I'll take this, one of these, and... This will make a perfect sound-gathering device. I'll send it to my tablet, 
decode a listening program, and we'll hear everything on the island. Whoa! There are a lot of things on the island. Yeah, but I don't hear Ozzy. <laughs> Wait, turn it up! Sounds like it's coming from Mystic Mountain. Head that way, Brawny. We're coming for you, Ozzy, buddy. Help! I'm stuck. Can anyone hear me? Help! <laughs> Did anyone else hear that? The bush is talking. Help! Fast! Fast help! There he is. Ozzy, down here. Rusty Ruby, hooray! I got myself into a pickle. That's okay. We'll get you down. Thanks. And hurry. There's something scary up here with me in the bushes. We need to get Ozzy down. But how are we going to get up there? I've got just the thing. Robo arms. Great thinking, Rusty. We'll be up to Ozzy in no time. Oliver, we found Ozzy. Yes! <laughs> But he's stuck on Mystic Mountain. No! Don't worry. We'll rescue him. Yes! We're coming, Ozzy! Okay! Ronnie, can you give us a boost? Sure. Whoa! You're one neck high already! Too much. Yeah, we need to find another way. Ozzy, we have to come back for you. Okay. I'm hungry. I'm sure just one berry won't upset the bush. Um, Rusty? Ruby? It's Ozzy! Bad news. I fell and I'm dangling from a branch. And I'm holding a baby raptor who's a little scared. And also... Help! Oh no, Ozzy! We need a new plan. Help! How can we rescue Ozzy and the baby raptor? We need something that can go down into the crevice to get them out. And it needs to get there fast. By flying! <gasps> Dak! He's always up for a challenge. Dak, we need you. Dino Flight! <laughs> Dak is back! Time to wing it! Greetings, r, r What's up? Ozzy and a baby raptor are stuck in a crevice up on Mystic Mountain. Can you help us rescue them? At your service, I'm ready to lend a wing. Thanks, buddy. Let's combine it and dino design it. We'll start with Dak. Then add an extendable chair so we can pull Ozzy and the baby raptor to safety. And a turbo headlight to see into the dark crevice. Put it all together and we've got our plan. Tight. If 
It's about to get a little extreme! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Hey! I've got some serious extreme flying moves, huh? Who's the bot? I'm the bot! Oh, yeah! <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> now let's get Ozzy back to Oliver. Oliver, we're back! Ozzy! Oliver! <laughs> oh, bros, oh, bros, let's go! We did it! <laughs> <laughs> Bye, buddy! Are you okay? I was a little scared, but now I'm okay. Rusty, Ruby, Dak, I can't thank you enough for finding Ozzy! We're happy we could help. Yes! It was awesome! I got to do a mega dive! I was all like, whoosh, and then, and then I whooshed, and then I whooshed some more! <laughs> that was fun. Ooh, and I found some of our favorite berries. I think raptors like those berries, too. <laughs> Rusty's Dactyl Dilemma. Only one more to go. Where are you, Dak? Velocity will never find <laughs> Gotcha! Because I'm the best hide and seeker ever! You did find everyone super fast. Sometimes it takes me all day to find Oliver, even when we're not playing hide and seek. Oh, give me another chance, Velocity. Come on! I know a great new hiding spot. We'll see about that! One, two, three. Perfect. I don't know about this, Ozzy. <laughs> this is an awesome spot. Velocity will never find me here. Eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Time for some speedy seeking. <laughs> This boulder was too small. Found it, Ruby! Found you, Rusty! <laughs> now I just need to find Dak. This is the best hiding spot ever! Oh, pretty music. It almost sounds like steam vents erupting. Something's wrong with my 
hear us? Are you okay? <laughs> I'm okay. But I can't fly. I'm stuck. It looks like his wing joint is broken. And the water is rising. Uh, yep. Yeah. Rising pretty fast over here. And I can't swim. Bad. Very bad. Not good. We have to get to him soon. Before he gets swept out to sea. No problem. You're looking at the fastest thing on the island. Me! Awesome. But we need a new wing joint for Dak. And all the parts are back at the dock. Ozzy and I will get the part and meet you by Dak. Great idea. Oh, bros, oh, bros. Let's go. Let's <laughs> bolt. Rusty, this way would be the fastest to Dak. But the chasm is in the way. How are we going to get over it? Velocity, have you ever wanted to fly? Um, yeah, just like every single day. Great, because we can ride you over the vents and the air will launch us over the chasm. That sounds amazing! Go, go, go! We have to time this just right. Okay, Velocity. Run over the vents. Now! It's working! I'm flying! The last vent is the biggest. I've had better days. The water's getting closer. We'll be there soon. We just have to get through the jungle. Velocity, stop! <laughs> um, I like the fast stop thing. That was fun, but why did I stop? Something's weird about that sand. Suspected quicksand. Hmm, there are lots of vines here. Wait, maybe we can swing over the quicksand. Rusty, you have your grappling hook, right? Oh, yeah. Never go anywhere without a grappling hook. We can attach it to velocity and swing over the quicksand. That sounds fantastic! <laughs>
pressure to pull Jack to shore. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Ronnie, we need you. Pronto, pronto. Put stuff away! Put... 
store for a minute, and when I came out, my ice cream was gone. Well... My ears! <gasps> Mr. Higgins is in trouble. My precious gears. They're missing. Did you see who took them, Mr. Higgins? No. And they took a bucket of shiny new bolts I had out front. This is a real mystery. Yeah, it's the case of the missing ice cream and gears. And bulls. <laughs> we'll be detectives like Sir Snooperific. I keep these detective hats handy, just in case there's a case. Detective Rusty, Detective Ruby, and Detective Liam are, are on, on the case. case. Now what? Now we search for clues. Hmm. Ooh, a bolt! It must have dropped out of your missing bolt bucket. One down, a bucket full to go. Maybe there's more around here to show us which way to go. Yes! There's a trail of bolts! Don't worry, we're on the case. Let's bolt! And follow the bolts! <laughs> Rocking! There's another one! <gasps> I think I saw it! It went around that corner! Another bolt! We're on its tail! It's at the playground! We're too late. All the playground equipment is gone. Eep. Not that swirly slide! No! no! Why would someone steal a playground? Maybe those kids saw who did this. Hmm. Let's go ask them some questions, detectives. Hello, did you see what the person who took everything looked like? Ooh, I'll draw what they say. I'm great at drawing, especially dinosaurs. But a dinosaur probably didn't do it. Here, Liam, you can use my tablet. Thanks, Ruby. Okay, what did he look like? He, he was no tall. Shape. Uh, no uh, short green hair. Mm -hmm. he was wearing he was tall. Boy boots. Mm -hmm. So whoever took everything looks kind of like this. He went really fast. It was kind of hard to tell what he looked like. Hmm. So whoever's taking things is sneaky and fast. It's going to be hard to find him. So let's make him come to us. We'll set a trap, then lure him with some kind of bait. We know it likes ice cream, so let's use a giant ice cream cone as bait. Giant ice cream? This is the best plan ever! But isn't all of Sammy's ice cream missing? Sammy keeps his favorite, chili pepper kiwi, in the back of his shop since no one else likes it. We can even put some bolts on top, like sprinkles! Good plan, Detective Liam. You help Sammy make it. Rusty and I will build the trap. Let's make something great! Awesome! That'll catch whoever's taking things for sure. Yep. I give you... Giganticone! <laughs> now let's go hide! Ha! We got him! Hi. Sorry, I wanted to try the ice cream. <laughs> okay, now let's all go hide. Liam, not again! It wasn't me! It bent the bars of the trap. So it's not just fast and sneaky, it's strong, too. Wait! Stop! Help! <gasps> Officer Carl! <laughs> What's wrong? Someone took all the traffic lights, so now no one knows when to stop or go. <gasps> Taking stuff is ruining the entire town. We have to catch him fast. But how? Whoever took all that stuff is super sneaky. Too bad Sir Snooferific isn't real. He always solves the case. Oh, we can make our own Sir Snooperific. 
Yeah, a super deluxe detective bot. Let's combine it and design it. We'll start with a super strong robo detective body. Then add a rocket pack to keep up with the speedy thief. And last but not least, we'll give him a mega magnifier for super sight to help follow its trail. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Time to go mobile! Did that. Whoa, he's good. Detectomatic can use his mega magnifier to spot clues and send them to Ruby's tablet. Using mega magnifier. Mm. Whoa, I can see everything. Wow. Pebbles, ants, a tiny drop of ice cream. That's it. The gigantic cone is melting. Detectomatic, follow the ice cream drips. I detected that too. Look what Detectomatic found. Strange tracks. Analyzing now. Hmm, the tracks aren't from a car or a bike. Maybe a bot? That'd explain why it's so fast and strong. One second. I am detecting our culprit straight ahead. After him! Culprit located. <gasps> it's your cleaner out for 5,000! Oh, wait, what? It's getting away! Not on our detective watch. What? And put it all away. Gigantic cone. I missed you. Put stuff away. Put stuff away. Don't let it get out. I'll push its off switch. Put stuff away. 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 The cleaner upper is damaged. That explains it. Looks like it's short circuited. The good news is, I can fix it. And then it'll be a good guy cleaning bot again. And put this stuff back. Great detecting, Detectomatic. You're as good as Sir Snooperific. Yes, Liam. I detected that too. Put stuff away. My beautiful gears. And my yummy ice cream. How's your ice cream, Liam? <laughs> Mega delicious. I detected he would say that. <laughs> <laughs> Rusty's Chilling Rescue. One more bucket of sand, and behold, I give you Castle Rustalot. <gasps> All we need now is water for the moat. Elephant bot, would you do the honors? <laughs> Nothing 
seemed like a nice moat to cool down a castle on a hot summer day. <laughs> Sounds like your trunk might need a tune-up, Elephant Bot. Sounds coming from the penguin. That explains it. Wait, no, it doesn't. Why is there a penguin in Sparkton Hills? Aw, the poor little guy looks scared. And he's getting farther away from shore. He's gonna float up to sea. We need a penguin rescue. The ice flow is too far for my grappling hook to reach. Good idea, Elephant Bot. I can use your trunk to get closer. Stretch as far as you can. Don't be afraid. We're gonna pull you to shore. Sure, little guy. <laughs> Looks like Elephant Bot has a new friend. A new friend who's far away from his home and family. <laughs> he must have floated all the way from the snow fields. We have to get him back home. Looks like we're going to the Sprocket Snowfields. <laughs> Elephant Bot is all packed and ready to take our new friend back home to the Sprocket Snowfields. Time to get you back home. Before we go, we need a name for you. I think he kind of looks like a Skippy. He likes it. Skippy it is. Everyone aboard the Elephant Bot Express. Next stop, Skippy's home. Them. Hang in there, Skippy. It won't be much longer. Or maybe it will. There's a storm forming in the Sprocket Snowfields. If we don't hurry, it'll cut off our path. We've got to beat that storm, Elephant Bot. Full steam ahead! <laughs> How are we doing with the storm? It's going to be close. Elephant Bot? Whoa! There's no way Elephant Bot can climb down an ice cliff. We need to find a way down before that storm stops us from getting Skippy home. Don't worry, Skippy. No ice cliff or storm's gonna stop us from getting you home. Yes! Yes! Wait, what? <laughs> That bird gave me an idea. If we can't climb down the cliff, then we'll glide to the bottom. Yeah, except one tiny problem. None of us can fly. Not yet. <laughs> Try to glide over it, Elephant. 
so close. Skippy's family is just on the other side of the wall. There's no way to go through the ice wall. And it's too big to go around before the storm gets here. So the only way is to go over it. What's up, Skippy? We don't have time to play right now. We need to figure out a way to get over the ice wall. I don't think Skippy wants to play. I think he's trying to tell us we can make an ice slide and slide over the ice wall. Great idea, Skippy. We just need to build something that can blast enough ice to make a slide. <gasps> and we need to do it fast! The ice storm is really close! Hmm. We've got everything we need right here. Hey, buddy, want to help us out? <laughs> Elephant bot saved Skippy before, and he can do it again. Yeah, let's combine it and design it. Elephant bot and make his trunk blast ice. Then we'll give him skis so we can move around on the ice. And last but not least, rockets, so he can turbo sled super fast. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. this big tree, but she's not here. Ooh -ah! Ooh -ah! Yes, I am! <laughs> Hello down there! <laughs> Hi, Ranger Anna. What are you doing up there? 
I put my monkey viewing platform up where the monkeys are. I'd invite you up too, but my ladder is gone and I can't get down. What happened to it? Good question. You might want to ask my friends over there. <laughs> <laughs> monkeys love monkeying around. They can't help it, they're monkeys. <laughs> but I'm gonna need that ladder back. Did you try asking? Several times. Watch! You see what they said? Um... We don't speak monkey. Oh, right! They just keep saying banana. Banana, banana, banana. But I already told them I don't have any bananas. Huh, that's weird. Right? And meanwhile, I'm stuck in a tree. Don't worry, Anna. We'll get you down. But how? The tree is so ginormous. Let's see what we have in the mobile rivet lab. It's lab time. <laughs> What can we use to save Ranger Anna? Let's see. Oh, I've got it! I could get up there if I bounce from branch to branch. Good idea. Let's make something great. Ta-da! Bouncy shoes, nice. I'll be up in a second, Ranger Anna. Go! I'm rusty. Rust. Whoa! 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 <laughs> um, think you can hurry it up a little? Or I might get down the bad way. Yikes! By falling! Wait, that's it! You can fall down, because we'll build something to catch you. To the mobile rivet lab! <laughs> Amazing. I was getting worried for a minute. Just jump straight down onto the bullseye. The bounce tacular ranger saver will save you. Cause you're a ranger. Woohoo! Here goes nothing! <laughs> <laughs> Now the monkeys took our ranger saver. We'd better come up with a new idea. And fast! <laughs> Whoa! Rusty! Guys? Number one, this platform is very hard to stay on now. And number two, help! Hold on, Ranger Anna. We'll have you down in no time. through trees. Or had something great at swinging, like our own monkey. Wait, we can make a robot monkey. It has to be big and strong enough to carry Ranger Anna down. 
like a gorilla. They're smart and super powerful. <laughs> Let's combine it and design it. We'll start with robotic arms, with big hands that are super strong and super soft. Perfect for swinging through trees and carrying Anna. Then I'll program him to be a fun gorilla friend. And last but not least, we'll add a body with powerful legs, like a real gorilla. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Strong. I'll say. Help! Okay, big guy. Ruby and I can help you find sturdy branches. Big branch on the left. Go. <laughs> now that curvy one on the right. <laughs> now uh, two branches up on the left. Watch out for that bird's nest. <laughs> Atta boy. <laughs> oh. Whoa! Jaguars! Nice work! Good boy! Oh. <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> I like him! <laughs> we do too! Okay, Botterilla, let's head back down. <laughs> Thanks for the lift, guys! <laughs> <laughs> Why do the monkeys keep taking things? What are they doing with it all? Well, studying monkeys is why I'm here, so let's go see! Follow that monkey, Botterilla! Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! took the ladder, springs, and ranger saver to try to reach those bananas. That's why they kept saying banana over and over again. This is incredible. Monkeys using tools. <laughs> I've read about it, but I've never seen it in real life. They're brilliant. Come on, let's go help. <laughs> You two. We got our stuff back, they got some delicious food, and I'm not stuck in a tree. Woohoo! 
And we've got an awesome new friend, Botterilla. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Botterilla has some new friends, too. <laughs> <laughs> with a nice hot cup of cocoa. Mm. Oh. Oops! You lost your head! Come back, Mr. Snowman's head! <sighs> ah! Liam, sled away from that snowball! Whoa! Help! Liam! Are you okay? No. I'm awesome! That was super fun! Let's do it again! I think Mr. Snowman ate us. We have to stop here. The road is covered in snow. Where did Liam go? And where did the ranger station go? Let's check my tablet. <gasps> it's buried under all that snow! Kids. Hi. There you are. For a second, we were worried you were trapped in the ranger station. Where are you? We're trapped in the ranger station. What? <gasps> Can you get us out? The snowman festival is starting soon, and I've been waiting all winter for it. You two sit tight. We'll have you out in a jiffy. <gasps> Whoa, this snow's too deep to walk in. Something made for snow. A snowmobile would be perfect. It's too bad we don't have one. Maybe not a snowmobile, but we could make a blizzard bike. Let's make something great. <laughs> Woohoo! Blizzard bikes are fun. Okay, Ruby, I'm going in. Nope, the snow's just too deep. Even a blizzard bike can't climb up it. <gasps> I've got it! If we can't go on the snow, we'll go over it instead. We'll make a zip line. <laughs> I hope Rusty and Ruby get here soon. I don't want to miss the snowman festival. I'm sure they will. But in the meantime, how about I tell a story? Oh, yeah. I love stories. Once upon a time, long ago, I was hiking the freezing Arctic in search of the elusive snow leopard. But instead, I thought I saw the legendary snow creature. It was all white and gigantic and said, <laughs> One zip line coming up. Now 
to dig them out. And I finally found my missing backpack way up in a tree. To this day, I'm convinced it was the work of the legendary snow creature. Whoa, that's so cool! You know what else would be cool? The Snowman Festival. I wonder if it started yet. <gasps> the legendary snow creature? Or Rusty and Ruby coming to rescue us. Uh, uh, they have to be down here somewhere. At this rate, we'll have them dig out in approximately... 37 days. That's definitely not soon enough. What do we do now? Okay, we need to make a plan so we can rescue Ranger Anna and Liam. We need something that can get to the ranger station without sinking in the snow. But is still strong enough and big enough to dig the station out. Maybe something that could jump from tree to tree over the snow. <gasps> Butterilla! And we'll give him new parts for the snow. Butterilla, we need you. <laughs> It's time to combine it and design it. We'll start with Botterilla for his amazing tree jumping skills and mega ape strength. Then we'll add a snow plow shovel so we can dig Ranger Anna and Liam out fast. And last but not least, a snow blower to blast away the snow. Put it all together, and we've got our plan! Chillbot, we need your help rescuing Liam and Ranger Anna from under all that snow. But we can't step on the snow or we'll sink. We have to go over it by hopping from tree to tree. Oh. <laughs> I knew you'd like that. Come on, let's get hopping. All right, let's bounce. play hide and seek anymore. I want to make a snowman. When are we going to get out of here? Soon. I hope. Just a few more to go. <laughs> Time to dig deep. You're all good. We're almost there. Just a little bit more. Stop! <gasps> <gasps> the legendary snow creature. Awesome! Rusty! Rusty. Actually, that's Botterilla. He's just covered in snow. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get you out of here. Nice! Aw, they already started the snowman festival. Don't worry, Liam. 
We'll get down there in no time on the Botterilla Express. <laughs> on your birthday, Ruby. Best birthday present ever. <laughs> Be back soon, but not too soon. <laughs> Have fun, Ruby! Okay, Bits. Operation Ruby Surprise Party is a go. from Sparkton Hills will be here. And Sammy's making Ruby's most favorite ice cream cake. <laughs> Perfect party. Wait, what are we missing? <laughs> of course, an epic dance floor. Now everything's set to make Ruby's surprise party perfect. Let's go see how Sammy's coming along with that cake. <laughs> There, kids. Are you all ready for Ruby's surprise party? Wouldn't miss it. I'll be there as soon as I finish testing my new super powerful drawbridge motor. <laughs> oh my, I guess my motor is a little too powerful. I knocked the power out to the whole bridge. Um, not just the bridge. That could be a problem. Looks like the power is out all over Sparkton Hills, Mr. Higgins. And at the beach. Oh no, what about Ruby's party? I'm sure I can get the power back on in time. You two just worry about getting everything ready for the party. Okay, Mr. Higgins, we're off to get the cake. Call me if you need any help. Will do. <laughs> uh... All right. Boy, am I glad to see you guys. The power's out. Without power, Ruby's ice cream cake is going to melt. No! Don't worry, Liam. No ice cream cake is going to melt on my watch. Hmm. What's up? I know. We can use Whirly's super freezer attachment to keep the cake cold until the power's back on. Ooh, I love it! Let's get a freeze on, Whirly. Blow that cold air down. Okay, time for the cake. Ruby's gonna be so surprised. Shh, it's Ruby. Hi, Rusty. Oh, hi, Ruby. <laughs> Wait till you see how super cute these baby turtles are. <laughs> they really are adorable. I'm glad you got to see them. What a great birthday you're having. <laughs> Wait, are you shivering? Uh, yeah, it got really cold here. <laughs> <laughs> huh, strange. Anyway, we're heading back soon. No! I mean... <laughs> Don't worry. We have lots more pictures to take. 
great. Well, see you soon. Ish. Phew, <laughs> that was close. We'd better get back to the beach. People will be arriving any minute. I'll just tag along. I'm so glad we saved Ruby's cake. The party would be ruined. Uh-huh. But you know what else could ruin a party? No party goers. Sorry, Rusty, Liam. <laughs> Turns out I had to order a new part to fix the power. Won't be here till morning. But Ruby's party is tonight. How is everyone going to get to the beach if the drawbridge doesn't work? There's no other way around. I'm afraid you'll have to cancel. No, there's got to be a way. I know. People may not be able to cross the bridge, but with a little extra oomph, the mobile rivet lab could jump it. Yeah, we could pick everyone up from the town and bring them over. Then the awesome surprise party that got ruined until we fixed it, then got ruined again, would be fixed again. <laughs> Let's get this party bus on the road. <laughs> I'll let everyone know you're coming. Okay. Okay, everyone's on board. Liam, Bits, we need to make a mobile rivet launcher to get us all across. That sounds like a plan. <laughs> All right, everyone, buckle up. We need to get back to the beach before Ruby does. Here we go. Ruby should be here any minute. Who knew a surprise party would be this hard to pull off? But now that everyone's here and the cake is saved, what else could go wrong? It's Ruby! <gasps> Hi, Rusty. The lighthouse isn't on, so it's too dark to get back tonight. <sighs> oh, no. We're gonna turn around and come back in the morning. No! I mean, I'll call you back. Bye! That's so weird. I was just wondering what else could go wrong. How can we have a surprise party if the person we're surprising isn't coming? Huh? We've got to get her back. I ruined the party. If I hadn't blown out the power, Ruby and Ranger Anna would be able to see the lighthouse. We're not giving up that easily, Mr. Higgins. Right, Liam? Right, Rusty. They can take our power, but they'll never take our party! Yeah! I know. We can make our own super rustified lighthouse. Hold tight, Ruby. We're coming to get you. Glad to hear it. Because we just got stuck on a sandbar trying to go back. We'll be here waiting. Great. Let's combine it and design it. <laughs> First, we'll supersize Ray and put a bigger lens on him so he'll shine extra bright. Then we can use Claw to boost supersized Ray up high so we can see. Last but not least, we'll attach them to the rivet shark so we can go mobile. Put it all together and we've got our plan. Rescue Lighthouse 5000! Oh. 
<laughs> we'll be back with Ruby, and then we'll get this party started. All right, Ray, let's bring Ruby home. Time to bolt! Ranger Anna's boat has to be out here somewhere. <gasps> Ray, back to the left. I think I see it. There they are! Hooray! Hey, Rusty. Ruby, Ranger Anna, we're going to tow you back now. Oh, thanks, Rusty. Okay, Liam. Deploy the grappling hook. <laughs> Engage forward thrusters. Just a little more. <laughs> We're going home! <laughs> now we just have to tow them back to the party. They're coming! Everyone get ready! <gasps> Ray, make sure to keep your light away from the mobile rivet lab so Ruby doesn't see the party guests. Oh, oh. Thanks for coming to get us, and for the ride back. Well, it's not over yet. <laughs> Tea. Huh? What's not over yet? Okay, everyone, now! Surprise! <gasps> what? Really? Happy birthday, Ruby! Happy, Happy birthday, Ruby! You did all this for me? I can't believe it! We wanted you to have the best birthday ever, because you're the best friend ever. Ta-da! My favorite ice cream cake? You guys thought of everything. Thank you all so much. So let's get this party started. Fire up the dance floor. Irma. This is amazing. I've always wanted a dance party. I know. Best party ever on my best birthday ever. Rusty's Ninja Fish Rescue. for a twisting rivet shark loop de loop. <laughs> now an upside down tail chaser. Look, it's Ninja Fish and his Ninja Kids. <laughs> Even ninjas like to play catch. <laughs> hey there, Ninja Fish. And little ninja fishies. <laughs> Aw, they're adorable. <laughs> oh no, their ball broke. We can give them our beach ball. Great idea, Rusty. I'll load it in the launcher. Play ball! That's for you to keep, Ninja Fish and Little Fishies. Have a fun game! Out of the boat? Uh? I don't think 
he understands us. Probably because we don't speak octopus. Oh, I know what to do. Maybe the octopus will let go of the ship if we give it something else to grab onto. Like, uh... That stuff laying around. Great idea, Rusty. Oh, oh. We'll pick them up with the rivet shark's vacuum, then toss them to the octopus. <laughs> Whoa! It didn't just catch them, it's juggling them. It's really having fun. Sure is, but it's still got arms on the ship. And the ninja fishies are still trapped inside. What are we going to do now? I've got an idea. We can use the rivet shark's grappling hook tail to tug the ship away from the octopus. Then ninja fish and I can help the ninja fishy swim out. Can you take over the controls, Captain Ruby? Aye, aye, Westy. Ready. In three, two, one, launch! Okay, Ninja Fish, ready to distract the octopus? Okay, Captain Ruby, Operation Tugboat is a go. Roger that, Rusty. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Try now, Ninja Fish. Oh, so close. Now, go. Ruby, pull harder. If someone told me I'd be playing tug of war with a giant octopus today, I'd have said, no way. With those suction cups on his arms, he's got a really good grip. He's not gonna budge, Rusty! Oh no! We need a new plan. <laughs> and fast. <laughs> the ninja fishies are still trapped in there, and that octopus isn't budging. How are we gonna get the octopus away from the ship? It's got too many arms. Oh, I know. We'll be back soon, Ninja Fish. I've got a new idea. The octopus has eight arms, so we need eight arms too. We'll turn the rivet shark into an octopus sub. Let's combine it and design it. We'll start with the rivet shark. Then we'll add eight arms. And last but not least, suction cups for the arms. Just like the octopus has for gripping things. Put it all together and we've got our plan. Time to go mobile. Give Ninja Fish a hand, or eight. Hey there, Octopus. We look like 
like you now. Oh? Give me a high five. <laughs> On the side. Again. Uh -huh. And again. Oh. oh. That a boy. <laughs> Over here. Away from the ship. Uh -huh. Ruby, keep the octopus busy. I'm going in. Oh. <laughs> You've got it, Rusty. The suction cups are stuck to the chest. <gasps> we did it! We saved the ninja fishies! Oh? Oh. <gasps> oh. 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Let's get those ninja kids back. Turbo power on! <laughs> you can't lose us, or Octocell can go anywhere you can. <gasps> I think the octopus is trying to hide. Now's our chance. Ninja fishies, you're coming home. Oh. Back home again. Huh? Why'd he take the ball? That was strange. Do you think he wants us to throw it back? Like catch? Yeah. Here, octopus, catch. You're right. It's playing catch with us. It wasn't trying to trap Ninja Fish's kids. It just wanted to play with the ball. And earlier, it really was playing tug of war with us. And hide and seek. That's why it's been smiling. It just wanted to play with us the whole time. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah. That's so cool. <laughs> but he's still getting the hang of hide and seek. <laughs> we'll work on that. <laughs> 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 